Hey guys, it's Megan here. Um, I just wanted to pop on really quick and show you guys um, one of the beautiful things about Gatsby as far as their portrait um, retouch collection goes. This is just an image. It's just one that I took out um, because I did not have a wide enough aperture, so um, or a small enough aperture, I'm sorry. Um, so my front girl was a little bit out of focus, but I just wanted to pop on real quick and show you guys um, how easy it is to really work with this new collection. Um, he, this model is kind of, he's got a little bit of rosacea, um, and the mom really wanted me to try and fix it as best as I could. Um, obviously it's not that hard of a fix. Um, there's a few different ways that you can work on this. Um, this is the portrait retouch collection, but what I'm going to do just to kind of start everything is I'm just going to grab my healing tool, um, the spot healing tool right here, and I'm just going to go in and try to take the bulk of everything off um, just to kind of speed up my process just a little bit more, um, make it a little less time consuming. Um, yeah, so I'm just going to kind of go in here and blot on here just to try and get it pretty good for the most part. <clears throat> and there's obviously several ways to do this, but this is how I'm going to do it, especially if you're really new with using the actions and you're not 100% on Photoshop, you know, like all the little things you can do. Um you can go and you know kind of piece some of these together so I'm gonna go in here I'm gonna play ransack the reds now you're gonna see it's gonna kind of wash his face out a little bit so he's kind of pretty gray but that's all right because what we're gonna do is I'm gonna come in here to this de -blotch smoother right here and I'm gonna play it and it's gonna really smooth him out on here. I mean, it's just night and day difference just in that alone. Okay, so then I'm gonna come down here to the skin tone palette and I'm gonna play Almond. I just happen to know this is his color and I'm just gonna go in here and basically paint his color back on his face. Now, if for some um, of, of everything that you use, if you happen to um, do a little bit too much on it, you can always drop down to bring some, a little bit more of his color back. So I don't want it about that much. I want it about right there. Okay, I'm also going to tone his um, de-blotch smoother down as well, just because I still want him to have some texture. Um, the dude smoother is also very, very good. Um, it's really not a whole, whole lot. I'm not going to use it, but I'm just going to show you guys kind of how it looks. Um, it's really good about keeping texture. You obviously don't want a man's face to look super airbrushed. Um, you still want him to have a little bit of texture in there. So that's pretty much it. Um, it's very, very simple. Let me show you guys the revert. So that's the original and then the fixed version. So super simple. Um, you know, as you're going through, you can go ahead and do the rest of your edits at that point. You can obviously go over the eyes to make them pop some more. Um, I love the new eye um, stuff that's in this one. It's really, really great. Like I said, this is the Portrait Retouch Collection. I love it. Uh, they needed this a long time ago for sure. Um, just tone those down a little bit but yeah so that's pretty much that so if you guys have any questions 
let me know and I'll put my link down in the comments for y'all. So happy shopping. Talk to y'all later.